How are you doing everybody? I'm Shane Ritchie and let me give a little, little insight to Kemper UK. I first got interested in um, holiday parks, motorhomes, caravanning, camping sites many years ago um, as a 15 year old working at uh, holiday parks and from then worked my way up to caravans and only a few years ago I did a show for Channel 5 called Caravanning with uh, yours truly and it was um, it was a show that was just a little insight to people who may or may not be interested in caravan parks and chalets and glamping and camping. And and from there, um, I did a big trade show in Birmingham where I come across a gentleman by the name of Dean Hyde, who owned a company called Camper UK. And I kindly asked him if there was a chance I could try a motorhome out. I mean, when I say motorhome, you're basically talking a penthouse on wheels. And we struck up a relationship there, and then a couple of years later, we become um, good friends. And the, the, what I like about this particular establishment, A, it's vast. It's like coming into a wonderland of motorhomes. I mean, if even the idea appeals to you, or even if it doesn't, uh, it's definitely worth a, a journey from no what part of the country you, you live in to come to Lincoln and check out Camper UK because a, it's a family run business and that meant a lot to me because motorhomes is predominantly about families and having a family run the business uh, carries a lot of weight. So I met Dean and from then I managed to, t um, I kind of blagged one if I'm being honest, I blagged the motorhome for a couple of weeks and we had a great plans for me and my family to travel across Europe. Um, start from France, go to Spain, make our way to Portugal, Italy and dinner. But of course, the pandemic hit, not just the UK, but right across the world. Uh, and then we thought, okay, let's turn a negative into a positive. We kept hold of the motorhome and we went down to Cornwall. And I can hand on my heart, my kids had the best time. And of course, they wanted to, we wanted to go to Disney in Florida or have a, a wonderful holiday in the Maldives. But having a motorhome certainly wasn't second best and even to this day my kids talk about it so I'm here today to try out another one another motorhome uh, this one's the Katarga and it's beautiful and if you are thinking of um, as I said investing in a motorhome then I can't think of a better introduction than to come along to Camper UK come and introduce yourself and they'll show you around and I've got to be honest when I first got into one I was slightly intimidated by the technology of it all, you know, how do I use the, you know, what do I do when I want to go to the toilet? I mean, doing the number ones is all right, but if you want to do number twos and you've got kids, and is it private, how do I empty it? What do I do about the shower, how do I plug in, how does it drive, how do I do the beds? Um, and you can get kind of bogged down by the technology side of having a, a motorhome, but coming here and meeting some of the staff who talk you through it, and basically they'll take you through in layman's terms, because that's what I needed. You know, how do I work the sat nav to how do the doors lock? Then how to empty and out your, when you've had a number twos. All these little things I think, where does the water go when you've showered? How do I, what do I stock it up with? What do I need to bring from home? And all these questions, and if you've got a million and one questions, they'll have all the answers you want and they'll hold your hand through it. Because basically, you know, if you've either bought a new house or a flat, you speak to the landlord or the, uh, the recent owners, it's like buying, uh, property but imagine having a property as good as your home on wheels and we've had some great adventures so far and in camping UK especially at the moment because st staycations are now going to be the new norm and what better way to kick start an adventure than with camping UK